<laughs> All right, it is time to play our new favorite game, What's It Worth? And it's with one of our favorite people, antiques expert, Dr. Lori. Every Tuesday on PTL, we ask Dr. Lori to appraise some of the items that you send pictures of. But first, David and I try to guess the value. Yes, and feel free to play along with us. And welcome, Dr. Lori. We always love seeing you. I love seeing you too. I want to introduce you to one of my inanimate dogs because I travel so much that I can't have pets. <laughs> this is Foundry. <laughs> and Foundry. <I'm> <laughs> I yeah, put dogs in the last segment, so I wanted to show you mine. <laughs> I love the, the Barbie on the table. My eyes were drawn to that. I know. Well, you know, we all want to go to the beach. <laughs> you know. She, she's dressed and ready for she the beach. She is ready. All right, so your she's first ready. item today is this mesh purse. And Heather and I were asking, what's a mesh purse? Like, do you see everything that's inside it? <laughs> no, it's not like the see-through ones, but it's, it's metal mesh. It's trying to look like beads. But in fact, it's metal mesh. So it's um, it's a very oh. nice piece, and it's mid-century. It was all of these objects were brought sent in by our viewers. So thank you, thank you, thank you, Pittsburgh, for sending them in. And this particular piece is uh, a gold tone, a silver tone, excuse me, and it dates to the middle part of the 20th century. What do you want to know about it before you guess what's it worth? How many were made? Like, was this a very uh, limited thing that only high-end people would own? No, it's not like, oh, there's only 2,000 Birkin bags out there, you know? Okay. A lot of them were made, so tens of thousands were made. I think you've said before jewelry is always in high demand, but w uh, accessories, would something like this be in high demand by somebody? <laughs> yes. Oh. Way up. A lot. A lot. Oh, yes. so. Accessories, very, very, very high demand, particularly of certain time periods. The 1920s is coming back strong, as well as the 1970s pieces. Hmm. So see that 50-year, uh, you know, movement there. All right, when you saw this piece, did your eyes light up? No. Oh. <laughs> I All thought right. maybe see? she'd give something My away. <laughs> okay. I see okay. Everything. Come on, you've seen me at the home show, all this stuff <laughs> coming through all the time. And no, that okay. didn't light up now. Okay. All right, we have our guesses. You ready? I'm you ready. go first. Ready? I'm going to say $900. What? Wow. I'm going 75 wow. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, 90 bucks. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, that's what I meant. Here, let me cross <laughs> that last zero off. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me keep score here. One for me. Okay. Okay. I have a feeling okay. I know how this is going to go. All right, next up is a blue gem necklace. Okay, blue gem necklace. What do you think? I like this. I thought this was very pretty. Well, again, it's a piece of jewelry, so yes. what do we know about it? What do you know? What do you want to know? Well, this is not costume jewelry, right? We learned about that the last time. This, this is something special, right? Yes, the stones are synthetic, however, but it is not considered costume jewelry. Okay. Hmm. And when was ah, it made again? That means, that means the metal is actually, the metal is actually a precious metal. Oh. Oh, so right? it's not the stones, it's the metal. Right, the metal's a precious metal. The stones are synthetic. They're grown in a lab instead of grown naturally. Oh, well then, so it has to be a more recent piece, right? No, it dates from about the 1920s. They were making oh. gems in a lab in the 1920s. Who knew? Yes. <laughs> okay. yes. All right. All right, well. Mm. Good, good thinking, what do you think? I, I'm just... Are a lot of these made? I feel like a lab-grown gem back in the 20s would be. No, not that many made. Is it made by any particular designer that's hot right now? Like Good some question. No. Okay. <laughs> See how she leads me on, and I think, oh, I got something. All right, I have a guess, but I'm I'm okay. spooked by my last guess. You go first okay. this time. I'm gonna say 120. I'm gonna say 125. Okay. Wow. 125 is exactly on the nose. Yeah. Wow. Okay, we're tied at yeah. one and one. Okay, stay with us. We're okay. going to take a break. Dr. Lori's going to hang around. We'll be right back.